A prettier variation on the same theme is an American flower called Phacelia. In trials, large banks of it have been planted around fields of sweet corn in the Isle of Wight. It was chosen because it provides an unusually rich supply of pollen for another aphid predator, the hoverfly. This time it's not the fly itself that does the work, but its offspring. Once it's been attracted to a field by the flower, the fly goes off to lay its eggs on the wheat leaves, where aphids are busy doing the damage. This is so that when they hatch, the larvae will use the aphids as food. In order to make the eggs, the female hoverfly needs a huge amount of protein from Phacelia pollen, and the more pollen she consumes, the more eggs she can lay. Within a few days, the larva is voracious, eating up to 40 aphids every day. In its beauty and simplicity, a biological control mechanism like this is unsurpassed. To farmers, it's been a revelation.